Okay, what's up, guys? Game three, final one, rubber match at Founders Park. What is up? What is up? What is up? Appreciate y'all tuning in yet again, man. We're rocking. We're rocking. What's up, Ben DeRosa, Travi Gad, TJ, Travis Allen, Alan Vaughn. What is up? Also, I know those in the Big Cock Club Discord. You guys are rocking with us as well. Many of you at Founders Park. Again, appreciate all those who are tuned in today. Very, very excited for this ball game as South Carolina looks to take the series. And I feel very confident they will do so. Um, let's see. Okay, we should be good. All right, awesome. Yeah, we feel very confident they'll do so. Again, feel really good about the game today, guys. I, I would be... Honestly, I would be shocked if South Carolina didn't get the W. Y'all let me know, by the way, if there's any technical issues, video, audio. I want to make sure y'all can hear me, see me. Everything is good. But again, I, I would I would be I would be stunned if South Carolina didn't get the win today. You know, you're on your home field. Jack Mahoney on the mound. Uh, Clem Sucks is scrambling with the pitching. You're coming off of the big win yesterday. I'll be really, really surprised if South Carolina does not get the win. So we shall see, though. Baseball is a crazy game, but uh, feeling confident going into this one as Jack Mahoney is towing the rubber as we speak, and we're about to get this one underway. Hunter Miller, what's going on, my friend? Appreciate you tuning in as well, my guy, as the first pitch is delivered for ball one. Need a good outing from Jack Mahoney for sure, man. Need a good outing from Jack. Been solid for you in his first two starts. Been Been very, very good, you could actually say, so. Need a good outing from your guy, Jack Mahoney, here. I think he'll give us one. How about that? Single, first A-B. Single for Clem Sucks. So they are on the bases early. Gamecocks in the Black Jays. Clem Sucks in the Orange Tops. Give the Tigers credit, though. They've been on the attack offensively uh, all weekend, man. I, you know, they, they, I don't know. They're an aggressive lineup. They're a really aggressive lineup. So they've, they've been on the attack all weekend. So, I mean, you definitely got to give them a lot of credit for that. Definitely have to give them a lot of credit for that, no doubt. So. Roll it, roll it, roll it. So it goes from a double play to first and second, nobody out. Just just got gotta just just gotta take your time and get one at least, man. Just a just a bit of a panic throw there. Mm, auspicious start, eh, James? James, I'm kind of surprised you're not there. I'm kind of surprised you're not at the game, my friend. Come on, Jack. Canarello's a good freshman, I will say. He's a really good freshman. He's balling for them thus far, man. He's a, he's a stud. Small little dude, but he's balling. Wow. The dramatics. The dramatics on the, on the line drive to right field, but he makes the play. Jeez. Boy. James, appreciate you tuning in, my guy. Again, all those tuning to the live stream watch along, man. Thank y'all so much. Appreciate it. This has been a huge success all weekend long. I've I've personally, I can tell you that I've I've personally, I've thoroughly enjoyed these. I've thoroughly enjoyed these. So um again, want to say thank y'all so much for it because I had high hopes with the live stream watch alongs, and I really felt like 
it would be a success. And of course, we have the rest of today, but uh, I, I think it's safe to say that it's really been successful all weekend. It's been great for me to be in the studio plugged in while still being able to conversate with you all and, and interact and engage. And, you know, it's, it's been incredible, man. We've had, we've had thousands and thousands and thousands of people tune in on Twitter as well, which doesn't even count really to the numbers. So uh, thank y'all. Thank y'all to those. If you can hear me, you're on Twitter. Appreciate you. I can't see your questions or comments or anything. If you want to to interact, you can do so on YouTube, Twitch, Facebook, really any other platform that's not Twitter. But, uh, yeah, so. Come on, Jack. Get him right here, babe. We got one We got one down. The score bug, if you're watching, is not, it's not working. Wow, has he fell that off? In other college baseball, by the way, yeah, other college baseball, um, Florida rocking Miami. Cormac, what's up, man? Yeah, Lynn Turner, appreciate you tuning in as well. Yeah, definitely. I, I, like I said, I'm confident we're going to take this ball game today. I, I'd be really, really surprised if we didn't. I mean, I don't, I don't want to be overconfident by any means, you know, but. Again, after winning yesterday on your home field, I you know Jack Mahoney on the bump. I they got just some random Billy slap dick out there. I'd, I'd be really, I'd be really surprised if you did not get the W. I, I'd be very, 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 very surprised. So we'll see though. Just those first inning jitters, man. It's it's. That first one can be – that can be tough. That first inning can be tough for, uh, you know, for a starting pitcher. So, I would know. That a boy. Nice. Oh. Outcome. My bad, guys. That was yours truly. Uh, let's see. Brandon, what, what's up with the errors in the field? <sighs> it's a good question, Brandon. I mean, I just sat on that double play ball. You just, uh, you know, Jack's just got to collect himself and make a good throw. That's it. I mean, that's literally it. So, um, I mean, it's a play that I'm confident that, you know, he makes more often than not. But, yeah, I, I just, I don't know, man. I don't know. We're, we're not we're not necessarily like an elite fielding team, I would say. We've been better. We've been better to start this year, but uh, I don't know. Yeah, Mahoney's just got to he's just got to settle down a little bit. Well, Jack, yeah, Austin, I don't know what's been going on with the score bugs. I have no idea because they're wrong yet again. Uh, they're wrong yet again. You got two outs. Two outs, three, two. First and second. Come on, Jack. Just throw a strike.
Yeah, well, Brandon, I mean, again, you talk about the errors, and there's been more over this weekend than you expect. I, I just think one of the things, too, is when you get into a when you get into a high pressure series like this, man, just, you know, I, I think things that don't ordinarily happen, they tend to happen. So I, I think when the pressure ramps up, you know, you're, you're more likely to throw the ball away or let's go. What a pitch. What a pitch. Dude, Mahoney's fired up, dude. Yeah, Mahoney's fun to watch, Austin. He's a lot of fun. I mean, that raw emotion he's got, I mean, it's just, it's a blast, dude. It's a blast. So, yeah, I love watching Jack. Dude's a competitor, ultimate competitor out there. So, yeah, he is the ultimate competitor, no doubt. Mm -mm -mm. Hope y'all having a fantastic weekend, by the way. Just a quick side note. Of course, guys, podcasts will drop tomorrow as normal, Thursday as normal. Uh, TDC every day except Tuesday and Friday. Uh, I'll actually be on the road all week long Tuesday. We're going to be down in Jacksonville for the Players' Championship. Um, going to be heading out to the practice round with the Carolina Cigar Boys, so I'll be out there all day long. And then on Friday, I will be out of town with family doing some stuff. So uh, just those two days, we won't have TDC. But, of course, tomorrow as normal, which will be a really fun one, we'll take your questions, comments, calls, and we'll react to everything that's happened over the weekend. So. Old Billy, old Billy on the bump for the Tigers. Hornung getting back in the uh, in the leadoff spot. How about this? South Carolina has hit a home run in ten out of their eleven games. The only one they have not was Friday. It's the only game that we have not hit a home run. Crazy man, absolutely crazy. Let's get it started. One five. Does this dude not have a name on the back of his jersey that everybody else does? I mean, I could be blind, but... Ah, yeah, I'd play. Yeah, he does not have a last name on the back of his jersey that is confirmed. Great 
God's heart shall be thy law. It's a good play. James, I'm glad you're enjoying the weather. You said 70 degrees in Charleston with a coastal breeze. Love that. I tell you, James, the uh, the coast might be my next move, my guy. I, I don't know 100% yet. I like Greenville a lot. I mean, this is, you know, I know this is something we talk a little bit more in the, in the Big Cock Club Discord and stuff because that's where I kind of share more personal type of type of matters, but, uh, you know, I, I like Greenville, of course, which is where I'm at. I like it, but uh, I don't know. I mean, it's 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 not one of those things where I'm dead set on it forever. I mean, there's nothing really holding me here, keeping me here necessarily, so I do love the coast. I, there's there's definitely a large part of me that would love to live down by the beach for a, for a year at minimum, so, yeah, might, uh, you, you might, you might see me down there, my guy, at some point, you might see me down Now, would it be Charleston? I don't know. I do love the, you know, Beaufort, Bluffton, Hilton, hit it, go. Go, ball. Let's go! Let's go on. What? I thought it was a bomb. What the hell? Bro, they just completely juked me out on the freaking on the on the on the stream here. Beamer ball hat sighting. Beamer ball hat sighting on the stream. Beamer ball hat sighting. Hold on, where did it hit? Bro, show the ball. Wow, I thought it went out. They made it look like it went out. They even they even flashed home run on the screen. Come on, Denny. Let's go, baby. Good God, Denny. Dude, Denny is so cold, bro. He is ice cold. Let's go! Cole Messina! Cole Messina! Let's go, baby, one nothing. Let's go! Funky Cole Messina. Let's go! Very nice approach, man. Just up the middle, didn't try to do too much. Hit it where it's pitched. Put a good swing on it. Voila. Dude, it's so sweet, too, when they talked all that shit to Cole Messina on Friday. It's just so sweet, bro. Get through. <clears throat> all right, that's fine. We'll take an early lead. We'll take an early lead. Out of bed. <clears throat> we'll take an early lead. Out of boy. Nice. Nice. We'll take an early lead. We will take an early lead. <clears throat> Love it. Nah, Travi, on the replay, it looked like it hit off the screen. I don't know. It was weird. I don't know. It was very weird. I mean, it would it have I guess it wouldn't have mattered, right? It's he scores anyways. So 
But uh, yeah, I don't know. That was weird. I mean, they they flashed home run on the stream, but uh, yeah, it didn't go out. So. Nice start. Very nice start. Very nice start. Very nice start indeed. Love to see it. Love to see it. Yeah, you couldn't have asked for it. You couldn't have asked for a better day at the yard, man. Could not have asked for a better day at the yard. Could not have asked for a better day for it. Let's go, Jack. Let's go, Jack. Fill it up, babe. Attack. Attack. Let's go. Is it packed, my guy? I figured. Yeah, I heard the, the tickets were like football prices. Football game prices. Call it out of it. Get back in the box, bitch. Yep, the biggest thing with with Jack man is just composure and 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 you know it's baseball is one of those games you, you know you can't play it like football with that that relentless aggression if you will it has to be more so channeled you know what I mean. Ooh, you know it's got to be more so channeled right as Clem Suck steals a base. You let yourself get too wild, too erratic. Come on, Jack. Come on, Jack. Work, babe. Work, Jack. Work, Jack. Controlled aggression. Very good, Lib.
It's a good pitch. By the way, shout out to women's basketball taking on Tennessee today in the SEC title. That'll be a fun one. Fully expecting, obviously, the Gamecocks to get the W, win the SEC tournament. What would be seventh time in the last eight years, I think, if they win? It's crazy, dude. Absolutely crazy. So, I think they'll get the job done. Oh, yeah. You're right. Thank you. I totally forgot. The score box. Yes. Thank you so much, Lynn. Very good. Yep, that's my bad. My B, my B. That's why I have y'all here. Keep me, hold me accountable. Call it. Attaboy. Nice. Good pitch. Good pitch. Good pitch, Jack. Atta, babe. Yep. Big first out. Big first out. That's a big first out there. Yeah, well located. That's, that's where you want to live. Oh boy. Just go right at him. Just go right at him, man. James says UT orange over the Clem Sucks orange, not by much. Yeah, I mean, I, it's definitely better. The Clem Sucks orange, man, is, is just is really tough. Yeah, it's, it's tough. Just make the play. Get that one at first. There you go. Nice, nice. Very nice, very nice, very nice. Very nice. All right, do what you got to do, babe. Get him out here. Let's go. Do a job. Strand him at third. Let's go. Be big. This, this would be big in regards to momentum, just keeping momentum. This would be huge, man. Huge. Wow. Yeah, this this would be massive. This would be massive. Yep. That boy. Keep it up, Jack. Keep it up, Jack. Let's go, babe. Yeah, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Sword. Sword. Call it. Oh. Well, we're tied just like that. Just like that. Mm. Well, ladies and gentlemen, walks kill. I mean, that's it. Just you can't walk a guy. Lead off walks. Yep, just can't walk, guys. Mm. 
Lead off walks, two out walks, and errors tend to score. So, you know. That's a shame. That is a shame. I will say that. I mean, no, it was definitely a good A-B. It was a really good A-B, but, you know, you just lead off walks, tend to score, bottom line. It just is what it is. So, you know, got to uh, got to be better. That's it, bottom line. So, we're all right. He's all right. He's all right. I mean, you tip, you tip your cat to that guy. Hunter Kelly, what's up, man? What's up, man? Uh, yes, James, we have thrown out a base runner, yes. I think we actually threw one out Friday. But not many. But not many, James. I will say that. It has not been very many. It has not been very many. That has been a, you know, it's interesting. That's been something like we haven't discussed a ton, but uh, yeah, it's, it's, it's been a sore spot. I mean, I'll say this though. I mean, Will Taylor, Will Taylor is a guy that really, really fast. I mean, that's not, I mean, he's a good base stealer. He's a good base stealer. So uh, Austin, are you at the game? Are you at the game? Play. All right, here we go. Here we go. Great day to swing it. Great day to swing it. Great day to score a lot of runs. Let's do the damn thing. I mean, this is this is this is our day, man. This is our day. This is our game. Just don't mess around. Take care of your business. That's it. You know, we're we're gonna we're gonna. We're in a great spot today, man. We're in a great, great spot today. So, oh, word. Okay, I got you, Austin. Yeah, I mean, it's you know the streams are generally behind, so it is what it is. I mean. Let's go, boys. Let's go. Bubba said off topic, but I'm so ready for some football. I hear you, man. Hey, everybody counts down to football. I just, you know, Bubba, I love baseball, and that's why, you know, again, this series is so important. And go ball. 
Let's go! Boom, baby! Let's go, Cassis! Gavin Cassis, Mammo Bomb! Let's go, Cassis! Let's go, lift off! Lift off! That's our 30th home run of the season, and the Gamecocks have now homered in 11 of their first 12 games. Let's go, Cassis. Two to one, two to one yard Cox runs in the first two innings. Not too shabby. McGillis content, dude. He's so we do the who's hot, who's not on the podcast every Monday. It's up between Denny and McGillis for sure because they, I mean, bro, they've been bad all weekend. I mean, you, you could technically just do Evan Stone again, but I, I don't want to keep picking on him. But man, they've been, I mean, they've been bad, dude. Yeah, I've seen a couple of pictures from, from Founders Park, man. It's it's electric. Postseason kind of vibe, man. Truly. Truly. Yeah, go ahead and let Evan Stone get on. Let him steal a base or two. Why not? Why not? Let him steal a base or two. Put him in put him in action a little bit. Evan Stone just like I, I I just don't I don't get the approach I don't get the approach for Evan Stone I I, I don't understand Evan Stone's approach man I don't know okay. And Evan Stone's approach. Austin, thank you, sir. Appreciate it. Thank you, Austin. I appreciate that. Yeah, stars on Facebook is a new thing. Stars. Stars are a thing. I, I, I don't really know what the stars mean, but thank you, Austin. Thank you. I appreciate it. Thank you so much, my friend. Thank you.
Let's go, Jack. Let's go, Jack. Get him here, Jack. Get him here, Jack. Ooh, good pitch. That was filth. Come on. Make a play. Make a play, Tal. Atta boy. Nice five. Nice five. Good play. Really nice play. Come on, Jack. Make that play. PFP, PFP. Wow. That was close. That was a great play. That was close, though. That was very close. Yeah, Wes, I would love to see the neutral site game in North Augusta. I'm a little biased because I'm from there, um, and I think it'd be cool to kind of go back to the to the home front and check out a game or whatever. But, yeah, for some reason, South Carolina doesn't make that trip, and it's close. It, it's, 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 a very, it's a very easy drive, but, um, yeah, I don't know. I, I'd love to see it. I mean, I, I, I've got no problem with the way it rotates now, but, you know, it'd be cool as Clem Sucks hits a single. I mean, it'd be it'd be cool. Yeah, John Edward, I, I think we all knew it was a sellout today. I, I don't think anybody – I don't know if they actually came out and, you know, I, I don't know that uh, – I don't know that uh, baseball announces sellouts like football does. But, uh, yeah, I, today was a sellout. No question. No question. 
Yeah, no question. Come on, Jack. Come on, Jack. Yeah, Jack's pitch count already at 55 as he throws this next pitch. Let's go, Jack! <laughs> It's just like with a guy like Mahoney, again, you, you love these guys that pitch with all this emotion, but I think sometimes it can be, you know, it, it can be a negative if you cannot control it. You know what I'm saying? It, it can be a negative. That's something that Noah Hall does really well is he just, he's steady, Eddie, calm, cool, and collected. You know, you should be able to look at a guy, you should be able to look at a guy and not be able to tell if he's up five nothing or down five nothing. You know what I mean? Like keeping that composure. So. Come on, Jack. That's a log. It don't matter. <clears throat> two out walks. Lead off walks, two out walks. Come on, Jack. That oh boy, nice, nice.
Got a boy Jack. Got a boy Jack. Get him here, babe. Go right at him. O2, go right at him. It's all right. Mm. I got one two on my screen, folks. One two on my screen against Will Taylor. 64th pitch upcoming. 64th pitch. Come on, Jack. Out of boy. Very nice. Very nice. Out of babe. boy, Jack Mahoney. All right, let's swing it a while. Let's swing it a while. Yeah, SEC Network's behind, my guy. Is what it is. Is what it is. Okay, so Clem sucks to the uh, – Clem sucks going to the pin already. So they are just going to Johnny whole staff through this thing. Olin Chuck. Wow. Olin Chuck, who we saw two years ago, start at Founders Park. How about that? Wow. Looks a lot different since he cut chopped all his hair off. Wes Clark's son. Didn't uh, Ty Olinchuk win a Dutch fork, right? From Irmo. Yeah, Dutch fork. Let's go, boys. Let's swing it a while. How about a long inning? Crooked number time, eh? Crooked number time, eh? Let's go. Let's go.
Good A-B. Good A-B. Good lead off A-B here. Come on. Find a way on. Base hit ball four. Find a way on. Let's go. Base hit ball four. Find a way on. Find a way on. Go ball, go. Shit. Mm. Jalen Hyatt's quarterback in high school. I didn't know that. Go, Will. Let's go, Wimmy. Go, ball. Go! Go, ball! God! Oh my gosh. Mmm. That close. That close. What's up, my guy? My guy tuned into the, the live stream. What a day, my guy. Great day to have a day, my guy. Great day to have a day, indeed. Indeed. My guy got me tempted to take tomorrow off and go hit the links. Damn it, my guy. Damn it. <laughs> oh, holy smokes. Come on, Denny. Dude, Denny's been... Ice cold all weekend, bro. I mean, I, I don't know. Has he gotten a hit? I think maybe he's gotten one. I don't know. And that's the inning. Canarella makes all three outs. Mm. To the top of the fourth, we go. Mm. Jay Smith, what's up, man? What's going on? Good to see you. Good to see you, Jay. We need, a, we need a quick inning from Jack, man. We need a quick, quick, quick inning from Jack Mahoney. Need him to get some efficient, like seven, eight pitches. Boom, boom, boom. Let's get the boys back in, the, back on the. Get the boys off the field. Get the boys swinging a stick. Get the boys swinging a stick.
Oh boy, nice, nice. Here we go. Fill up the zone, baby. Fill up the zone. Let's go. That boy, nice, nice, nice. Oh yeah, I forgot they played it. That women's basketball played at three. I thought it was four thirty for some reason. It is three o'clock. You're right. Well, get him right here. Get him right here. 69th pitch of the ball game. Very nice. Ah, come on. Just, just, just. You go, Jack. Get him right here. Wow, fair. Well. They're going to review it. Here we go. All right. Okay, well, never mind. I, I thought they were going to review it. Got to buckle down here. Got to buckle down here. <clears throat> Got to buckle down here. Button. He went. Yeah, he kept that. He kept that bat out. Come on, get him right here. Get him right here. God, that's a good pitch.
Well, I think at this point today, guys, if you can get five out of Jack Mahoney and it's still you still got a lead, I think you're pretty you're pretty happy with just the way this the way this day is gone, the way his day is gone. If it's if it's two one after five or you've held him to a run after five, he's probably gonna be quite he's probably gonna be about a hundred pitches. So I think uh Five complete, you, you you call it probably for him. I don't think I don't I don't think you throw him more than hundred pitches. I, I just you're not you're not gonna throw him more than hundred pitches. Come on, Jack. Come on, Jack. James Hicks in the pin. Come on, Jack. Come on, Jack. Yeah, hold him. Hold him. Good play. Yeah. Nice play, Wim. Uh, James Kendall, is there an ideal pitch to throw when someone wants to bunt? Yeah, up and in, I'd say. You want to make them uncomfortable, James. Something up. I mean, I like to go something up, see if they'll pop it up. Um, I mean, any any kind of breaking ball, James, can be good, too, just to make it more difficult. But I, I think one of the worst things you can do when somebody's trying to bunt is just overcomplicate it, right? They're giving you an out, you know what I mean? Just take it, like. Don't don't get so make that play. No! God! <sighs> Bro, come on. That's got to be caught, dude. That has to be caught. That's got to be caught, dude. It's got to be caught. That's a gift wrap second out, man. That's a gift wrap second out. Oh, boy. Mm. All right, here you go. Sorry. But no, James, I think what you can do is you can kind of overthink a situation and, and you know, then you find yourself behind in the count when a guy's trying to bunt. It's just. Get him here. That should be caught. Oh boy. Yeah, Heath, we we haven't been perfect in the field, that's for sure. That was just a I don't know, that was that was a that was an interesting 
interesting miss there. I don't know if just the wind, the sun, or or something. Something messed him up a little bit. Oh God. Make that play. Nice job, Jack. Way to work, babe. Way to work. Way to work. a boy. Very nice. Very nice. Way to work around it. Way to work around it. a boy. That's big, man. You got to give credit to Jack Mahoney. He might not have his best stuff today. He may not have his best stuff, but uh, he's fighting his tail off. So he is fighting his tail off, man. Really, really good stuff. You love to see that. Love to see that. Absolutely. Come on, let's score some runs, man. Let's go. Let's score some runs. Let's score some runs. Yep, got to pick him up. We need to break this thing open, man. Oh, somebody's uh, Beamer Ball Koozie spotting. Beamer Ball Koozie sighting on the stream. Love to see it. The TSUS merch is everywhere, man. I appreciate it. It's everywhere. Is everywhere. Go. Oh, God, the cameraman just completely jukes everybody out. I'm looking, we're looking, thinking it's it's 100 feet over the fence. Golly, the cameraman. Jeez. Mm, wow. Get through. Bro, we... Oh, that a boy. We, wow, went off his glove. Wow. I was about to say, bro, we are... We are absolutely shitting on the baseball. Let's go, Cassis. Let's go, Cassis. Let's 
Wow. You hear that? Gavin Cass is six of his 11 hits are home runs this year. <laughs> that's, a, that's, that's crazy, man. I mean, that's just, that's wild. Go ball. Go ball! Yeah, it's gone! Let's go! <laughs> Let's go! Do it again, Gavin Cassis! Do it again! Let's go! <laughs> Seven of his 12 hits now are home runs. Let's go! Woo! Let's go! <laughs> Let's go, baby! Let's go! Big time! Wow! Put a charge into it, Gavin Cassis! Times two! Wow, dude. Holy smokes, bro. Let's go! Dude, what? <laughs> Seven of his 12 knocks are bombs. All he does is hit mammo bombs. Let's go, baby, Gavin. Cast this dog. What a swing. I mean, dude, we, I, I was sitting there thinking. I was like, man, we are hitting everything hard right now. Go, ball. Go. Go. Let's go. Boom, baby, back to back. Let's go, Lee Croy. Let's go! All Ty Olin Chuck does is give up mammo bombs at Founders Park. That's all he does. That's all he does. That's all he does, bro. He did this last time. He did this last time. Let's go! Let's go! Hell yeah, we got to update the scoreboard. Bro, Ty o we are we are ripping Ty Olin Chuck's shit, bro. Let's go, dude. Let's go.
Dude, Olin Chuck's done, bro. Olin Chuck's done. Olin Chuck is done, dog. I don't know why he's still even in there. No way. No way. Oh my God, dude. Dude, McGillis almost just made it three in a row. <laughs> Holy smokes! Like, see, bro, like, that's, that's, Evan Stone hitting a pop-up is just not, it's not it. It's just not it. Anyways. Hey, great inning, great inning, great inning, great inning. Great inning, great inning, boys, great inning. Great inning, indeed. Hell yeah, great inning. All right, so South Carolina goes to the to the pin. James Hicks takes over. James Hicks in the ball game. Wow, Florida run rules Miami. How about that? Florida run rules the Hurricanes. I'll be damned. 14 to 4. Just crazy, dude. Just crazy. Gavin Cassis. Have a day, Gavin Cassis. Mm, wow. All right. Yep. James Hicks, fill up the zone. That's it. Go after him. Attack him. Attack him. Be on the attack. Be on the attack. <clears throat> Be on the attack. Here we go. Atta boy, atta boy. 
Very nice. Very nice. Yeah, Heath, I mean, I agree. Evan Stone should be hitting the ball on the ground every time. I, I don't know why that's even up for debate. James Kendall, I'm cool with that on a game three, but game one and two is when you obliterate the bullpen. You're cool with what? What do you mean? Hitting the home runs or what? A oh, run rule. Run rule. Yeah. Well, I mean, dude, they're all about shortening games, man. But but I'll say this, though, James. You say that. Wouldn't it be cool to run rule Clemson? What Clemson sucks? Wouldn't it be cool to run rule them? Like to beat them 11 to 1 today? Wouldn't that just be – that would be so sweet. That would be so sweet. Hunter Kelly, you should live stream football for away games this year. I'm way ahead of you, Hunter. That's, uh, you know, I'm not 110% sure, Hunter, what the plan's going to be, but I, I think that is going to be the plan. I'll probably do this for home games as well. Uh, probably going to do this for home games as well, guys. My, my days of going to games are, are I just, I, I've got to, I, I just, I want to switch it up. I want to do something different. It's it just really being there in person at games is of no advantage to me. I did it because I lived in Columbia and I, I was literally walking distance to all the stadiums and I was right there. But like from a pure content business perspective, there's no advantage to being there. Like not, not, there's not one thing that's better about being there versus being right here. Nothing, literally nothing. So that's where my head's at. That is where my head's at. Let's go, James. Fill it up, babe. Fill it up, James. Out of it. Yeah, Brandon, this will be huge, man. We hold on and, uh, you know, you take down Clem Sucks and and all the big sports, man. It'd it, it definitely be huge for sure. I mean, it's just, you know, feels good to own the state. Feels very good to own the state, my friend. Feels very good. Get him here, James. Nice pitch. Filth. That's filthy. Had a boy. Nice, James Hicks. Had a baby. That a boy, James Hicks. Very nice. Very nice. You feel good with him on the bump. You feel very good with him on the bump. Where, where hey, where, where are all the Clem Sucks folks that were trolling my, my stream on Friday? Where are they at? Anybody know? Anybody know where they're at? Where are they at? They asleep today? Where's Shadow of Death Valley? Does he not watch baseball? He only watches uh he only watches football when they're good. Is that it? Where are they at? Where's all the where are all those folks at? Weird. Really weird. Hmm. Interesting.
All right, let's pour it on. Let's go. Let's pour it on. Let's pour it on. Let's go. Let's pour it on, man. Bro, how about a run rule game, huh? How about a run rule game, James Kendall? How about a run rule game, everybody else? Why not? Why not? I'd take it. I'd take 11 to 1. Why not? I'll take it. Come on, stay within yourself, babe. Stay within yourself. Oh. Whoops. That a boy, nice. I saw Luke RJ. Feels good to be good. What's up, Luke RJ? What's up, babe? Somebody said Bon Secours is packed for South Carolina and Tennessee. Love to hear that. I I fully expect the Gamecocks to get the W, man. I, like I said, I'd be shocked if they didn't. Come on, Carson. Come on, babe. Shit. Yeah, it's ball four. Let's go, boys. Well,
Come on, Denny. Come on, Denny. Heat back up, babe. Heat back up. Heat back up, Denny. Come on, Denny. Heat back up, babe. Mm hmm. God, he's just going to throw over a hundred times, dude. Go, ball. Go, ball. That struck. <laughs> Score him. Score, Wimmer. Score, Wimmer. Score, Wimmer. Hey, let's go. Let's go! Denny doubles his bat! Denny doubles his bat! I thought he got it out. Denny doubles his bat, kid! Let's go! Let's go! Six to one, baby. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's keep it going. We're not done. We're not done. How about it, Funky Cold Messina? Let's go. Good block. Let's go, Cole. Drive something, babe. Drive something, Cole. Yeah, Austin, this is definitely the team we're expecting. You know, I you know, I, I look back at Friday, Austin, and I think you could just say, you know, baseball is a crazy game. And um you were on a you were on a you know rivalry series at a at a in a hostile environment for the first time this season. And you know, I mean Clem Sox played with, with a lot of emotion, Austin. I mean, that's not an excuse for Carolina, but I mean, you know. I think what you're seeing today and late yesterday, yeah, obviously that's what we were expecting to see. So, um, I mean, listen, it's baseball, man. You're going to have some moments where you have a game like Friday, and it is what it is. But you, you, I, I think what you obviously hope for is more days like today and late yesterday than what you get like Friday, right? I mean, I, that the frustrating thing for Friday, it really wasn't that, you know, there's going to be Friday nights or game ones against elite pitching where we struggle to score. It was the fact that, like, Clem Sucks did not even have their ace. You know what I mean? Like, it wasn't like you were facing some crazy elite arm, right? And, like, we like we all knew that. We all knew that. You know what I mean? So, it's like, that's what was tough to stomach. But, uh, you know what? I'll say this, Austin, as so many of their fans, as so many of their fans like to write off the football game, and said, you know, oh, you know, that was a fluke, fluke win. You know, you see some of them on Twitter. Well, it's going to be really fun after this when they say, yeah, that Friday, that was a fluke, my guy. That was a fluke. Clem sucks was frauds. We gave them game one just to make it interesting, but that was a fluke. That was a fluke. So, you know, let's keep the energy consistent across the board, eh? Madison says you may have called the series. 
you know, Madison, I mean, I, I didn't pick which game we would we would lose or whatever. I mean, I, I just felt like Carolina Clem sucks. I mean, I really believed that Clem sucks was going to give us their best shot. I mean, it's an emotional series. And as much as I would have loved to have swept them, as much as I would have loved to have swept them as we go to the top of the sixth, you know, it's it's just – it's so competitive. It's, it's hard to believe that, you know, one team's not going to win a game – one team's not going to win a game, right? So, I mean, it's, it's you know, like last year was – that was truly an indictment on like, wow, we are really, really bad. So. Austin, curious where D1 baseball ranks this Monday, knowing them will stay at 23. I mean, yeah, Austin, honestly, I don't think we move a lot. We're not going to move down. That's for sure. We're not going to move down. Um, we may move a spot or two, maybe. But, yeah, I, I, well, I mean, I would just say this. I, I, would, I would just say this, that... Yeah, I would just say that, you know, I, it kind of depends on how they value Clem Sucks, and I don't think they think Clem Sucks is very good. So we might, uh, you know, we might move up a couple spots, but I, I don't think it'll be a ton. So I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. Trying to pull up the score here of the women's game. Hunter Kelly, if you had to choose between two sports, football or baseball, what would it be? <laughs> well, I mean, Hunter, the good news is I don't have to ever choose, right? That's just, that's never going to happen. But, yeah, I get asked, make the play. Got to be quick, got to be quick. Come on, nice, nice. I get asked a lot, Hunter, about which do I, like, prefer or which one do I like covering more or which season do I like, what's my favorite. I mean, they're different, you know what I mean? As far as from, like, the game perspective, I actually probably love baseball more than more than football, if you will. I love baseball more than football, just from the game perspective, man. I mean, I played I played baseball. I mean, it, it's it, – it comes very naturally to me. Um, you know, I will say this. There's nothing like a Saturday in the fall in South Carolina. There's truly nothing like it. Um, so I love the game of baseball probably more, but again, there's nothing like college football, man, just the electricity and, and I'll be totally honest what it does for business and content, everything else. It's, it's, it's a lot of fun. Right. So again, luckily I don't have to choose cause I love both. I love both, man. I love both for sure. Uh, Blake Shelton is watching from Cocoa beach in Florida with my Clem sucks hat on Blake. You're the man. I love that Blake. Thank you, sir. That is absolutely incredible, my guy. I love that. Uh, 17 to 13, women up on Tennessee with 242 left in the first quarter. Just FYI. A four pitch walk from James Hicks. 
Come on, Janie's. Fill it up, babe. Fill it up. Fill it up. Fill it up. Come on. Just pump strikes. Pressure's on them. Make them swing it. Make them swing it. Go one, go one, go one. Oh, shit. Just didn't have a chance. Just did not have a chance. Hmm. Well, you pitch. Yeah, just keep going. Keep rocking. Keep rocking. Keep rocking. Boston with 10 points early. Five for five. Yeah, I think it's going to be a very fun day to be a Gamecock, ladies and gentlemen. It's going to be a very fun day to be a Gamecock. Oh boy, nice. Nice. Way ahead. Way ahead, 3-4. Way ahead, babe. Way ahead, three, four. Let's go, out boy, James. Out boy, James. Let's go, baby. Out of baby. Nice pitch. Filthy, filthy breaking ball. Filthy breaking ball, dude. That a boy. Oh, call it blue. That's a good pitch. That's a good pitch. That's a good pitch. Make a play. Make a play. Very nice. Very nice. Very nice. Very nice. Very nice. Very nice. We're rolling. We are rolling, ladies and gents. We are rolling, ladies and gents. Lake Seaborn, a lot of my money goes to your merch. Your merch is unmatched, my friend. Let's get some funky Cole Messina merch. Yeah, well, hey, we'll have to try to partner with Cole, but I appreciate that, Blake. Sincerely, man. I truly do, genuinely, man. It, it feels good to know that the uh, the work is appreciated and that we're, we're driving value for Gamecock Nation, man. That's that's a good feeling. And like I said, I, that's, that's really what it's all about. That's what it's all about, man. So thank you. Thank you. Sincerely, thank you. Grateful for that. Dude, this dude at Virginia Tech, Chris Cannizzaro, he is 19 for 25 since February the 26th. And he's a home run, home run away from his second cycle in eight days. 
That is insane. Good God. Wow. That's crazy. James said five runs incoming. I hear you, my. Let's do it. Let's do it, my guy. Let's do it. Let's do it. Why? Hey, why not, James? Why not? Why not? Dude, I'd love to see Cassis go yard again, bro. Why not, dude? Why not? Why not? Would that be incredible? Seven of his 12 knocks are bombs. That's just insane. Let's go, Gavin. Why not? Do it again. Ooh. He didn't like that. Let's go, towel. Let's go, towel. Come, babe. Come on, let's pour it on. Let's keep it going. Ooh. That looked really close. That was really, really close. Ah. Mm. Blake, again, I appreciate you, man. Said he listens every morning on the way to work. Thank you, sir. Appreciate you. Thank you. Thank you. Shit, this guy's carving. Shit, this guy's dealing. What is he telling the ump here? <laughs> yeah, this, this guy works insanely quickly. Get down. Get down. 
Hey! Boy, McGillis, sometimes that's all it takes. Sometimes that's all it takes. Uh, Madison, it is the bottom of the sixth. It is the bottom of the sixth. Will McGillis, for us, just got a two-out single. We're up six to one. So it is the bottom of the sixth inning. Almost got him. Yeah, I mean, I, th I think it's, Blake, you make the point about Monty Lee. I think it's very fair to think that he's had a positive impact. No doubt. No doubt. No question. Kendall, uh, what, happened to, what happened to Michael Braswell? Been getting this question a lot. <sighs> I mean, Michael Braswell is an infielder, and uh, Will McGillis was brought in to play second base. Braylon Wimmer slides over to shortstop, which was his position. <clears throat> and... Uh, so the spot that, you know, Michael Braswell was fighting for was at third. And, you know, Talmadge LeCroy, who's also a catcher, he and Cole Messina were fighting for that job. And uh, Cole Messina won it, and they love LeCroy's bat. And both guys were hitting very well. And just bottom line, long story short, LeCroy can also play third and play it at a high level and uh, just won the job. LeCroy just won the job. So Braswell was kind of the odd man out. Brat, what's going on, my guy? But yeah, Kendall, I mean, it, it kind of sucks because I, I, you know, I'd be shocked if, if Braswell doesn't transfer. I'd be, I'd be pretty surprised. I mean, I just, you know, and I wouldn't blame him. I, I wouldn't blame him at all. I mean, he wants to play, you know what I mean? So, how a boy Stone? Way to work a walk, baby. That's a bit. Come on, let's do something with it. A little two-out rally here. Come on, a little two-out rally. Why not? Why not? Come on, get you something you like and drive it. Get, get you something you like and drive it. <sighs> he tried to frame that. <laughs> he tried to stick that. Yeah, it's a, it's a, it's a, it's a nice environment at Founders, man. It's packed. It's 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 absolutely packed. They're they're just showing a pan of the of the stadium. It's packed, man. It's absolutely packed. Come on, get you something right here. Get you something right here on two two. It's an action pitch. He's gonna throw you his best shit, and I bet you it's gonna be a fastball. I bet you it's a fastball right here. Drive it. You get it. Drive it. Oh, that's down. 3-2. They'll be running. They'll be running. 3-2. Come on. Find a way. Find a way, baby. Base hit ball four. Find a way. It ain't got to be a home run. It's something in the gap. Find a hole. Let's go. <laughs> It. Just watch the breaking ball go down the middle, practically. It's all right.
Yeah, I don't know, Austin, what he's looking for there. Two strikes, I, I don't know. I don't know. That's just – I don't know. Got to pull the trigger there. I don't know. This women's basketball game looks very competitive. Let's see. Twenty six, twenty one, Gamecocks. South Carolina, I believe, is on a five zero run. <laughs> Let's go, James. Just fill it up, bro. Attack, attack, man. Like Robbie Davis says, attack, 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 attack. Twenty eight to twenty one Gamecocks women's. By the way, did y'all see the SEC tournament bracket for the men's side of things? That dropped. That's up. That's easy. Can of corn. Oh God. Bro, it's sometimes it's an adventure for Petri out there. Um bracket dropped for the men's side of things. South Carolina will take on Ole Miss on Wednesday night in the first round. Gamecocks are the 12 seed. So, I mean, dude, again, Lamont Paris, year one, you're looking for victories. You're not the 14 seed. You're, you're not dead last, right? You didn't finish dead last. So, you got to find positives in it. But uh, Carolina, Ole Miss, that'll be a really, really good game. And if you win, I don't know who did the scheduling, but uh, – Gamecocks will be matched up with Tennessee if you beat Ole Miss, who beat you by 40-plus twice the two times you played them. So, two quick outs. Love to see it. Two quick outs. Two quick outs. Love to see that. Love to see that. James Kendall says 31-21 women. Court Cox are on a 10-0 run. Love that. Love that. Feels good to be good, James. Feels good to be the best. Just feels good to be the best. Yep, out of boy, dude. James Hicks is dealing, dude. Dude, James Hicks is just—he's such a weapon, man. Like the fact that he's coming out of the bullpen for us. I mean, this is a guy that. This is a guy that could start on a weekend rotation at a lot of other schools. Like James Hicks at Clem Sucks is literally fighting to probably be their Friday guy. Like he's a weekend guy easily. He's a weekend guy easily, man. Attaboy, James Hicks. Way to work. Way to work. Way to work. Way to work. We six outs away. Six outs away. Let's go. Six outs away, baby. Let's go. With no cap, no cap, no cap.
Chase Floyd, do you think winning two of, th two of three against Clem Sucks moves us up in the polls? Yeah, Austin Greer brought this up earlier. I could see us moving up a couple spots, Chase. Um, you know, but what it really comes down to is how does D1 baseball, I, I think, you know, I don't know. I, I, you know, admittedly, I don't know exactly what everybody ahead of us did this weekend or has done this weekend, if you will. But, uh, you know, I, I know they don't think Clem Sucks is very good. I know they don't think Clem Sucks is very good, right? So, um, we'll see. We'll see. I mean, I, I think when you weigh in, though, that it's a rivalry series and, you know, the way you responded in the last two games of the series versus Friday, you know, I, I, I could see us moving up a couple, but, you know, I don't think we're inside the top 20 necessarily. You know what I mean? But, the, I mean, the fact of the matter is this. Win today and you're an eleven and one ball club through twelve games. Like that's that's pretty solid, my guy. That's pretty solid. So dude, he's I tell you what, this new this new Clem sucks pitcher, he's carving us right now. He's carving us right now. Let's go, boys. Yeah, Chase. No, we're, we're not going to drop. I'll put it that way. We're, we're not moving down, no question. We're not moving down, no question. Um, No, you're not going to move down for beating them two of three. You know what I mean? So, uh, no. Get down. Get down. Well, that was a quick seventh on to the eighth. Hey, six more outs. Thank you. 
Here we go. Blake said, for sure, this is the best team so far we've had in four, maybe five years. You know, we look good early, Blake. I mean, it's a long season. Um, and I'm not trying to say that to be, you know, I'm not being pessimistic, obviously. I'm just, you know, it's just a long season. But I will say, I think there are really, really encouraging signs at this point that point to, I mean, I, I felt like before the season, Blake, we have a good team. Like, we have a good team. You know what I mean? We've got talent. Oh boy, nice. Oh, James Hicks is dealing. James Hicks is dealing. But Blake, to your point, man, I mean, I, I you know. The question for this team, the question for this team still hasn't changed, right? We knew the pitching was elite. We know that the pitching is good enough to have, you know, to have a, a solid year. The question is, are we going to be able to swing it consistently enough to capitalize? Because to get to 40 wins, you're going to have to swing it consistently. You, you just, You just are, right? You just are. You're going to have to swing it consistently. And we're, and we're not – I don't think we're really going to know until we get to SEC play. So, I, listen, I, like, I, I don't think the question – I don't think the question is, like, are we better than last year? We're, we're worlds better than we were last year. There's no doubt. We're worlds better than we were. We're going to make the postseason. But the question for me is, are we a two or three seed? Are we, like, on the bubble, like a 15 and 15 or 14 and 16 SEC team and fighting to get in? Or are we a closer to a 40-win team, 16 and 14, 17 and 13 in the league, and we're hosting? You know what I mean? Like, who are we? And I think that it's all going to come down to how do you hit in conference play. That's literally what it will come down to. So, that a boy, James Hicks. Let's go. James Hicks is dealing right now, ladies and gents. The man is carving him up. Let's go. This is fun to watch. It's a lot of fun to watch. Flexing your muscles on the bump today. Come on, James. Get him here, babe. See ya. Let's go. Dude, James Hicks is just, he's feeling it, man. 
Three more outs. Three more outs. Three more outs. How about add a couple more? How about add a couple more? Let's go. Panic Ritter, you are a slap dick, my friend, but we love you. But we love you, Panic Ritter. We love you nonetheless. Yeah, Brandon, we talked about that a little bit earlier that uh, the men's team plays Ole Miss. Feels good to be good, folks. Feels really good to be good. Hey, uh, Madison, thank you for tuning in. It says, enjoyed the cast. I'm learning more about baseball each time I listen. Well, I'm glad to hear that, Madison. Thank you. Thank you. I, again, I want to say thank you all for tuning in. This has been a massive success. You know, I had high hopes for it. Um, I had very, very high hopes for it when, you know, I had the idea and, of course, we executed on it. But, uh, you know, this, is, this has been incredible. This has been incredible. So I want to say again, thank you all so much. And uh, you'll definitely be seeing more of these in the near future. No doubt. No doubt. I, 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 think, I think the next time we do these, it probably won't be until SEC play. But that first weekend against Georgia, I think there's a good chance that we will rock the live stream watch alongs yet again. So I'll keep you all updated, of course. But uh, I, I love these, man. I enjoy these because it's like I'm watching the game anyways. So, like, why not, like, why not create content while doing it? You know, why not create content while doing it? So – uh, it's a lot of fun. Dylan Brewer getting an A-B bottom of the eighth inning. How about this? No way. Let's go, Dylan Brewer! Dylan Brewer with a double against his old team. Wow. 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 You know that feels good. You know that feels good. You know that feels good. Hmm. Let's go, Cassis. What a fight, babe. What a fight. What a fight. What a fight. The Clem Sucks fans are imploding, ladies and gents. The Clem Sucks fans are imploding on Twitter. So many. So many that were loud 
and were vocal and were talking so much relentless shit have nothing to say now. Have nothing to say. Absolutely nothing to say. Mm -mm, mm -mm, mm. Isn't that something? Isn't that something? Just love to see it. Just love to see it. Add a boy, let's go, Tal. Add another one. Add another one. Let's go. Let's go. Add a boy, Tal. Let's go. Let's go. Bro, our state across the board. Football. Basketball. Both men's and women's. Baseball. Need I say more? Need I say more? Feels good to be good. Feels good to be rocking the garnet and black. Clem sucks. Sucks to suck. Sucks to suck, my guy. I guess you'll have your opportunity, uh, what, November? I don't know. November. Long time to wait. Long time to wait. And to explain Friday night, just like their fan base so conveniently does for the, the football side of things, it's simple. Friday night was a fluke. Clem sucks, stinks, and Friday night was a fluke. So they're very fortunate to have only lost two of three. So sucks to suck, Clem sucks, but that is the story of your life. So That is the story of your life. It is what it is. Such a shame. Uh, let's see. James, I'd love to see the walk off, man. I don't I don't know if we got four more in us, but it'd be dope. It'd be dope. Look at Evans beat that out. Evan Stone finding a way. How about Evan Stone and the runner gets thrown out at third? Of course. Nothing good can happen for some reason when Evan Stone comes up. All right, three more outs. Let's go. Three more outs, baby. Let's go. Three more outs, baby. Let's go.
Three more outs, ladies and gents. Three more outs. Three more outs. Finish it off, babe. Finish it off. Let's go. Finish it off, baby. Finish it off. Finish it off. Oh, the pod will be fun for tomorrow. The pod will be very, very fun, ladies and gents. The pod will be will be very fun. It'll be very, very fun. Oh. Two down, two down, two down. Ladies and gents, do you really think I wasn't going to have the Clem Sucks pack ready? Did you really think I wasn't going to have Tanner pipe your slap dick ass down, you loser? Go eat shit. Go eat shit, my guy. Literally go eat shit, Tanner Gibson. And all the other Clem Sucks trolls that came into the stream, which, hey, much love, but you can go eat shit. You can kick rocks. You can kick rocks. This Clem Sucks pack, it will not be lit up today because we're going to jump right into the pod. We're going to take, take, take care of business. We're going to take care of business. We're going to smoke this on TDC. Studio Stogue on a Monday. Studio Stogue. Studio stove. We are, we are going to enjoy this together, ladies and gents. We're going to enjoy this together. One strike away. One strike away. Clem sucks. You should be thankful you won a single game. That you won a single game. Be grateful. You should honestly, Eric Backage should get the extension for winning one single game. Because your team stinks. That's it. That's it. Our state, bitch. Let's go. Let's go. Our state. Our state. The clean sweep. Just like football. Just like football. Just like football. Just like football, just like basketball, just like women's basketball, men's, women's, whatever. Ho-hum. We expected to win that series. Ho-hum. Ho-hum. Ho-hum, baby. Ho-hum. Ho-hum. Clem sucks. You suck. We expected to win that series. I mean, honestly, I'm excited, but I expected us to win. So, I'm excited, but I expected us to win. Oh, 
And I did call it, two of three. Yeah, well, what do you know? <laughs> it's almost like I do it for a living. How about it? James Hicks gets the dub. Gamecocks hold that Palmetto Series trophy. And uh, feels good to be good. Feels good to be good. So, great job. Great weekend. Way to respond from Friday night. Way to respond. No, actually, James Hicks. Mahoney got the dub, even though he only went four innings. Interesting. Anyways, whoever gets the dub. Hey, great way to respond from Friday night. Truly, this team, I think, backs against the wall. It looked bleak yesterday. Uh, and again, man, you felt confident coming in today. You felt confident. I'm, I'm going to probably reiterate a lot of this on the post-game reaction. But, I mean, you felt you felt confident coming in. You felt confident coming in the day on your home ballpark. You know, the, the pitching advantage, the advantage across the board. The advantage across the board. So, feels good to be good, baby. We're going to re go record the pod. Podcast will drop tomorrow at 5 a.m., TDC will rock live noon to two. And like I said, guys, feels good to be good. We own the state and we'll smoke this bad boy on the Daily Crow tomorrow. You will not want to miss it. Y'all take care. Hey, thank you all so much for a successful weekend in regards to the live stream watch alongs. I had a blast. We will definitely be doing these more in the future. And uh, what a good time. What a good time. Guys, again, thank you all so much. Appreciate y'all. Have a great rest of your Sunday. We'll talk to you tomorrow on the podcast and, of course, on the Daily Crow Noon to two. Y'all have a great night.